Megan shocked. Archie's descent to Marquis of Bath triggered by compelling DNA evidence. Welcome to the Royal Revelations channel. Before we continue, please make sure to subscribe and never miss out on our newest videos about the British royal family. Following the debated succession bill on Monday, Archie has been downgraded to the Marquis of Bath title. The DNA results confirming the lineage were presented in line with Volume 744 of the succession to the Crown Bill that was discussed on March 13, 2023. This bill states that for an individual to be in line for monarchy succession, they must be born from the body of a royal member's spouse, with parentage from a person of royal blood. Additionally, the rightful heir must be born from an egg provided by the spouse in a lawful marriage, adhering to common law principles. The debate further established that every child in succession line should be biologically born from the body of their parents. This means that if children belonging to Megan, Catherine, Zara, Beatrice, and Eugene were born through surrogacy, they would not be eligible for the succession line. A precedent for such matters was set in 2016 when the Privy Council addressed a case involving a contested Scottish baronetcy. In this case, DNA evidence played a crucial role in determining the rightful successor, denying the adult son's claim due to evidence showing his father wasn't the legitimate heir. The possibility of hairs being displaced due to surrogacy and assisted reproduction was highlighted, particularly when scientific evidence is conclusive. Notably, Megan's father, Thomas Markle, claimed that Megan underwent a hysterectomy at Queen's Hospital in 2016. Consequently, it is highly unlikely that Archie will lose all his royal titles, including Prince Archie, Earl of Dumbarton, Lord Dumbarton, and others, to eventually become the Marquess of Bath's son. UK rules dictate that for a baby to be part of the succession line, they must be carried by Meghan. If she was never pregnant, her two children cannot be included in the line of succession. The circumstances surrounding Archie's birth have raised doubts. The announcement lacked doctor signatures, the timeline appeared inconsistent, and there were no witnesses to Megan giving birth. Moreover, various claims emerged, such as the doctor who allegedly assisted with Lily's birth shutting down her practice. A woman who was claimed to be Archie's birth mother visited the Montecito Manor, seeking to see him. Reports about Megan's changing baby bump size and appearance also surfaced, adding to the uncertainty. Some instances seemed perplexing. A photo showed Megan squatting while heavily pregnant, which medical experts found implausible for a woman in her condition. Typically, pregnant women experience altered walking patterns, yet Megan's gait appeared unaffected. Questions persisted, revealing deeper complexities in this matter. For instance, it's implausible for a woman who had undergone an epidural to walk within two hours of giving birth, as it paralyzes the lower body for several hours. What are your thoughts on this remarkable turn of events? Do you find the DNA evidence convincing or do lingering questions still persist? We invite you to share your insights and opinions in the comments below. Your perspective adds depth to the discussion, enriching our understanding of this captivating tale. Let your voice be heard. See you in the next video.